the title of this poem is Rigged Pharma. I can't wait for you to get sick. I have something that will do the trick. Keep in mind that you won't be cured, but symptoms will disappear, rest assured. Although side effects will take their place, I promise you it is perfectly safe. Now something like this doesn't come cheap, it'll cost you the money you earned in a week. Our original goal was to get you addicted. Any effort to stop leaves you afflicted. Perfectly legal it isn't a crime to profit off you for your lifetime. The government will support our acts after supplying them with greenbacks. Other solutions will do you no good, just take these pills as you should. The tier research for outside facts successfully labeled those doctors as quacks. This industry rakes in by the billions, with prescription drug abuse in the millions. I promise it's safer than drugs on the streets, although we've caused the end of more heartbeats. Our most hated one of all is weed, cannabis research is an awful deed. We don't want you high off THC, and we don't want you cured with CBD. If a cure exists, we must stop it. How in the world would we profit? This is a business first and foremost, so we don't care if we have you coast. Convince you that you need us the most. So sorry if I begin to blow. All this money would make anyone boast. You have no say and you have no vote. Go against us and you are toast. Ask your doctor if Rick Farmer is right for you. Warning, side effects include definite suffering, unhappiness, anxiety, constipation, too much more to fit inside. The title of this poem is Moving Forward. I don't want to lose her. It's like I spiritually abuse her. It's not funny, but it's likely to amuse her. That she might be with a loser. Took advantage of my title appointed to be her special one and only boyfriend but now our relationship feels so disjointed changing schedules she's tired of disappointment saying one thing then doing the next i thought i was supposed to be the best i thought i would hold her to my chest i thought i would kiss her down her breast i thought i would lay her down to rest and proceed to give her bomb ass sex but then i started getting spotty with the checks but then i started giving her disrespect if I was smart and used my intellect, I would look back and begin to reflect on my own mistakes instead of trying to deflect. I need to look at myself and start to inspect. To discover more so I can detect all my reasons for being in debt so that I can gather and start to collect all these monies for a foundation. I will manifest all my creations and rid myself of negative vibrations and rid her of her pent up frustrations. I have the encryption need a translation. Make a lifetime profit for a lifetime vacation. All the time in the world to give her relations. Talking about rhythmic orgasmic sensations. Or dining in quality eating crustaceans. Lost in our state of beautiful magic. Strength and consciousness, mindful expansion. And father our kids, I'll be the example. I am the tree and they are my apples. Abundant are we as we will be fruitful. The number one lady, I love you oodles. Each part of your soul, the whole kit and caboodle. If I could draw, then I'd stick to doodles. Together forever, babe, I just know it. As sure as I am a lyrical poet. This poem is titled, School. I remember the days of school. Useless information, I was a fool. Conforming young minds to become tools. Until your open mouth is starting to drool. Of course they had to make it boring, then get mad at you for snoring. They take away nap time and recess, but introduce standardized tests. Too many blanks on a written test page, so they decided to put the answer in your face. You memorize answers just for that day, but you never learned it so it fades away. Need permission for the restroom at 17, then ask what will you do in life at 18. That's a pretty big jump it seems. No expression, just sit down and listen, subconsciously coerced into submission. We must rise and fight this battle before we become mindless cattle. Explain why my past and ancestors are a mystery, but I must learn the white man's history? All I've ever seen are my people in misery, minds destroyed, no respect or chivalry. Come on students, get your pencils and pens, platitude and riffraff all over again. School becomes a job 7 to 3, and we look to weekends to be free. 
Feeling sick? I have a hunch that it came from minimum quality lunch. We wonder why some teachers don't care when they are given minimum quantity fare. Why do I need theme, mood, and tone? Teach me how to grow and live on my own. I do not wish to be a drone. Do what makes you happy and comes natural. Perhaps skills and arts innately substantial. The shift in your life will be massive. You'll be one in a million among the masses. Create, write, sing, or draw. You are perfect. You have no flaws. Act, compete, study, or heal. Never stop pushing your wheel. Your sole purpose they tried to steal. What I'm teaching is useful and real. Thirteen years of sitting in class. I learned more on my own. I was a dumbass. If you enjoyed it, hey, that's cool. Just giving another perspective from school. That's it for me, folks. If you enjoyed this walk, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Class dismissed.